to today's tip. Now, from my holiday, I ended up with loads of bus tickets and receipts of all of the places that I visited, and I thought I would make a fabulous background to my scrapbook page. So I've got a gel medium. This is a semi-gloss gel medium, but any PVA glue would do um, to stick it all down. And I just thought I'd show you just a few tips just to, um, give you an idea about how it would look. Now, I wouldn't go with a um, uniform approach. I would always have it, because we're going for a wallpaper look. So I would have some of it coming off the page um, and I will trim that afterwards and just sort of hickledy pickledy. So just bearing in mind that if you do do it uniform, your eye's gonna be drawn to it. We actually don't want the eye drawn to it because we want the eye drawn to the photograph on the, um, that's going to stick on top of the page. So I'm just sort of randomly putting these tickets in. I had so many and you know what? I could probably keep them, but would I do anything with them or would they just end up in one of my boxes full of holiday things that I've never done anything with. And I thought, you know what? I would much rather these be used on a page. So I'm just sticking them in. That's roughly how it's going to look. I'm gonna take a photograph of that now so I can remember when I come to doing my sticking down. And then I'm going to pull it all off and start the sticking process. I'm just using my brayer here just to make sure that everything is stuck down and there's not too many bubbles in there. It's got a bit of gold paint on it, but that's not too much of a worry. And then I am just finishing it all off with one lovely layer of this gel medium to A, make sure everything's stuck down and to B, just give it the same look um, and feel because otherwise some bits will stick out as being um, sort of clear and other bits will be covered in the in the medium so we want to make sure that that is identical what I'm going to do is I'm going to let that all dry I've still got one here that I think I might try and add into it and then it really does need to be left to dry completely so that when you go and add your photos and your embellishments or whatever you're going to do with it it will be nice and ready to go. Okay, so I've let this dried overnight. Now, the bus tickets have, unfortunately, the ink on there was just so, so light, so I've lost that, but I'm not worried. All of these other colors look fantastic. I'm going to mount it on this lovely cardstock here, and I've just put my photograph and a few embellishments onto some vellum that I'm going to stick over the top, just to really kind of mute down some of those colors inside that, and then I'm going to trim that off and that's my final layout keeping it really really simple this was a photograph on the archaeological area um, which is the tickets here and it all matches up beautifully I'm so happy with how it's come out I hope you've enjoyed this tip and I look forward to seeing you next time